Happy Tip Tuesday, golfers. In this next tip, we're going to talk about lower body stability. You know, everybody wants to be more consistent when they hit the golf ball. But at the golf school here, we see that lower body being way too active. One leg straightens, the other kicks forward, one's kicking in and dancing around. There's all kinds of movement. We just captured a golf swing focusing on my knees in the 3D Motion Capture Studio. Jake, let's have a look at this and show people how little they move and how they stabilize me in my golf swing. Yeah, so the first thing, so everyone sees what we're looking at, we have two points on Kevin's knees and we've measured the distance apart of the middle of the joint. So in this case, he's 11.78 inches spread out with the two knees. That's, That's about right typical. with a mid iron, right, Jake? I tend to kick my trailing knee in, my back knee in a bit to stabilize me from, from swaying and turning into my leg, but that seems like a pretty good number. Yeah, obviously with the stance it's going to affect it, but I would say that's very normal for most good players. Okay, so let's see how much that moves around because so many people move around with their lower body thinking that that movement will develop speed and power. Where am I, you know, uh, halfway back? Yeah, so here you are at waist high. Okay. You can see at the point we're still at 11.82 degrees. So as your chest and hips are winding, your knees are starting to turn but they're not significantly moving around in space. And we'll see that continue through the entirety of the backswing. Essentially, the knees are rotating in space, That's but they're amazing. not significantly kicking in towards each other at any point. Yeah, 11.61 now, so within you know, two inches. A, a portion of an inch. Now, Jay, can you go to above, please, and just show us what they look like? And you know, there's not a lot of rotation, right? We see that lead knee popping forward and that back knee moving way back. No, agreed, they stay very in line. So. Obviously, when your hips and knees are square at a dress, they're going to be in line like they are right now. That continues through the first part of the backswing. And what we will see again is as you rotate, your knees will turn a little bit, but they're staying very in line. And that's important because it is a good example of lower body stability and how the pressure is going to stay in the right part of your lower body throughout the entire golf. Yeah, swing. so they're supporting me. They're staying in place for the most part, and that allows me to be consistent. That's totally. how I would summarize that. If the lead knee is kicking forward or the trail knee is kicking significantly back, that is going to mess with your balance and the pressure into the ground, which will affect your power dynamics. Love that. All right, let's look at me coming down, about halfway down in the, in the downswing and just see what they're doing and how they work together. They still work together, right? That separation stays there. Or does it actually get a little bigger, Jake? Yeah, it stretches a little bit. As your lower body leads and your lead knee tends to squish onto your front foot, we see a little bit of a stretch or a squat with a lot of really good ball strikers. So. Uh, I guess I'm giving you a compliment there, but yeah, nice. you can see how the number stretches a little bit in transition. So it grows, the knees stay relatively in line, and then as the hips rotate into impact, the knees rotate with them, but we retain that initial, or very close to that initial amount of spread we had at the start of the golf swing. Well, we gotta get golfers in here to do this, because that is so cool to see from above, but the message is, let's stabilize the knees, let's quiet everything, control that backswing with the upper body rotation, allow the legs to move and work properly, but they need to work together and properly. I really like that. So there you go, golfers. Not too much leg action if you want to hit your best golf shots. Thanks for watching, golfers. Like this tip, subscribe, and check out all of our other tips.